Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com, and we did it. We filled up that 10 box Prospects, Rookies, and Stars baseball mixer. There are all the people involved in this, so big thanks for the big rally. Um, if you see a little rooftop or a carrot above your name right there, that means you got this in a recent spot randomizer. And there are the teams. All teams are in. Okay, let's roll the dice eight times for this. One for each list. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. Right? I said eight, right? Yeah, six and two, eight. Uh, Corey, you're on the poll. Kev California in the number 30 spot. And once again, eight times for the teams. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven and eighth and final time. There we go. Good luck. Texas Rangers on top. Walker, Texas Ranger on top. And Cleveland. I don't know why I said that. I'm losing it. It's too early in this. It's my first day of the week. I've got four more nights to go. Can't be like losing it right now. All right. All right. So here's how it all shakes out. So once again, Rangers on top, Indians on the bottom. Okay. Corey, you got the Rangers, Michael G, White Sox, TJ, Blue Jays, Jeremy 33, Cubbies, Michael Ben Y, Mariners, Michael G, Tigers, Andrew Wagner, Reds, and Pirates, Big Boys 007, uh-oh, he's a Northern California guy, he's a Giants guy, you end up with the Dodgers, Oppo Dave Mojo for you, you get my Dodgers, Jeremy 33, Red Sox and Nationals, Ryan with the Padres, Darren McKenzie with the Brew Crew, Last Spot Mojo for Michael Van Y, Los Angeles Anaheim Angels, uh, Diamondbacks, Mike Coons, Reno with the Rockies, Chris McKeague with the Giants, David Kist with the Astros, Michael Van Wy with the Yankees, Victoria, <laughs> OMG says David Harrell, Victoria with the Dodgers, Phillies for Victoria, that was from a spot randomizer, Ed with the Marlins, Andrew Wagner with the Tampa Bay Rays, Samuel with a spot randomizer, Kansas City Royals, Brett, you got the Mets, he, uh, he has them for trade already, Kev California Twins, TJ A's, there you go. Oh, no. He has J Jays and A's are also for trade. Danny Erickson with the Orioles. Michael Van Wy with the Cardinals. Kev California with the Indians. Wasn't there more people who had... Oh, yeah. So that's spot randomizer. That's spot randomizer. That's spot randomizer. So good luck uh, to you guys. I think you saved five bucks. Right? Maybe a little bit more than that on this uh, on this mixer. Anyway, going to pause the video, see if there's any trades uh, when we come back. We'll be right back. All right, welcome back, everybody. Some trade talk, some trade chatter, but uh, no no deals at the end of the day. So here on a Tuesday night, Jaspi's 10 box prospects, rookies, and stars baseball. Make sure that list remains the same. Good luck to everybody. Thank you for the fill. We started the day off with a lot of spots, and then we we kept grinding, we kept grinding, and we ended up here to Breaksville. So I appreciate that. So we're gonna go in uh, in chronological order. So we're gonna start with 2013 first. Three autos per box in this Panini Hometown Heroes. All right, so good luck to everybody. Now, we will have time for, uh, by the time this is done, and I put this break away and print out the labels and do all that jazz, uh, we should have time for at least one more longish kind of break. So we can, um, we can go, like Spider-Man takes about half an hour. We can do a two-box break of that. That should be pretty easy. Uh, we can do, um, what else can we do? I guess we can do Bowen's Best. That takes about half an hour. We can do that. <laughs> Kevin California is like, I've gotten so much worthless autos out of this hometown heroes. Well, just for that, there might be, there may be some coming your way. <laughs> Angering the hometown heroes, gods. I know there's some good ones in here too, aren't there? You gotta take, you gotta take the bad with the good. If every auto was good, how would we? I mean, they can't all be. You gotta have good with evil, right? Good with the bad. Otherwise, you wouldn't know how to define good or define bad. It's all relative.
All right. Well, let's see what we got out of here, folks. All right. I've heard of this guy. Are there any kind of like parallels in here? I forget. I did one of these boxes last time, but I think these are parallel. These are some sort of short print or parallel, right? With the with the foil stamp of the city. So I'll set these aside. Do we have anything like serial number or anything like that? I don't know. Well, that that Lenny Dykstra is that Mets edition of Lenny Dykstra? Yeah, Mets edition of Lenny Dykstra. And is that Larry Boa? Larry Boa autograph. The fiery Larry Boa. For Philadelphia, that goes to Victoria. Right there. There's the district. Oh, okay, so there are zip code and state parallels, but the zip codes are rare and they have a blackboard. Okay, so we should be able to spot those pretty easily. I'm a sucker for these, Kev California. I don't know why, but I really like those. That goes to the Blue Jays. Uh, Matt Williams. The Cobra! Stop. Did they really call Dave Parker the Cobra? It's a little bit before my time. There's Gary Pettis. I think Gary Pettis came to my elementary school one time. Was he a gold glove one? I think he brought a gold glove. I'm pretty sure he came to my elementary school and brought his gold glove, which was which was the coolest thing that I've ever seen in person in my young baseball loving life. Did I pass a blackboard? Oh. Is this it? No. Wait, is this what you mean by blackboard? This is something? All right, well, Joe Carter. Blue Jays. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah, it is different. All right. Randy Johnson goes to Arizona. I guess apparently this is this is this a different board or is that just a base border? Oh, it did. I didn't think it would. I apologize beforehand, folks. Uh, the TJ received his break number one. All right, well, we've got to be more careful about that. Paper base will not ship from these Bowman products. I thought they would, but... All right, that's a gold board. Well, I, say, I saved it for the Cubbies. Good old Kerry Wood. I don't think I... Gary Templeton? For the Padres, Gary Templeton, autograph going to Shogun. Well, you have, you can make a case for it, TJ. I'm sure it's in a, I'm sure it's in a monster box somewhere. I think I forgot to write it in this one too. So these are these gold borders, apparently are parallels. I'll just set those aside. Should be expecting one more autograph out of here. I think it's right over there behind the little pog looking thing. Oh, so, so we were just talking about this. Mark Grace, Cubs, Jeremy 33, Kev California saying that these zip code ones are shorter printed. So that's pretty cool. We're learning things, folks. 
And we've got Jerome Walton. I don't think I've ever heard of this guy. I'll be honest with you. And I feel like a 10-year big league veteran? Uh, I mean, okay. I feel like I know my... See, the Ryan Express is real. Zip codes are one per... We didn't see one in the last mixer. Maybe I did. I don't remember. There's Missouri. Oh, another zip code. Rick Dempsey. Jerome Walton starts. See, I, I remember Rick Dempsey. There's Mark Mulder. Maybe that's where the extra zip code card was. We didn't see one in the first one. All right. There you go. Good old Rick Dempsey. that aside there those are the parallels Larry Boa autograph Gary Templeton uh, I was gonna I was gonna, just gonna set this aside look at this later um, might as well look it up right the yeah the the helmet the helmet suggests Cubs yeah, it's Cubs. He never played for the White Sox. So that'll go to... Well, the mixers will take longer to ship. There's just too much. If, the, if we did send paper base, I would have actually take, taken many more days after that. We'll figure something out, though, TJ. Don't worry. All right, Cubs, Otter, that'll go to Jamie 33. All right. So now we that was 2003. Oh, I love these guys too. Get these and we're gonna move on to 2014. Is that right? Kev California is saying, Kevin's saying, Kev California is saying it's, uh, Walton was a big prospect car for collectors back in the day. Was he really? Yeah, I apologize about it. We'll, we'll figure it out, TJ. Don't worry about it. Don't go with, I'll dig out some Schwarber and Bryant cards for you. And I'll send them to you. See? Done. Easy. Hopefully, I'm, I'm sure that monster box is still here with all, full of all this stuff on the way. Oh, come on. I don't want these to be backwards. That screws everything up. Oh, it's just that one card? Yeah, this is this is a huge box. This is the super jumbo, which includes what three autographs per box.
Now, if they're all upside down every which way, there's no rhyme or reason. So we're going to have to deal with this. Um, yeah, uh, I think we apologize for not putting this in the item description, but... But the, uh, the paper base for this, is, I know it just says no veteran base. Paper base will, all, will also not ship for this, just the, just the chrome and the hits, obviously. All right. It's kind of cool it's like looking back at 2014 because you can start to see some of these players start coming up the ranks. Hunter Renfro is playing pretty much every day, right? So there you go. He was drafted back in 2013, 13th overall, you know, so it's cool to start seeing these guys, uh, start to, uh, start to emerge nowadays. Aramis Garcia. Nick Gordon, Julio Udius, Chrome. Got White Ice, Alberto Mora, Purple. 70 out of 99. Trey Turner, Chrome. Yeah, TJ, we'll work it out. Relax. We'll figure it out. I get it. I'll 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 dig out some of, I'll dig out some of the paper myself if I have to, man. So we'll this will be fine. <laughs> Got some minis in there too, mini Hunter Renfro. Trey Supak, autograph for the Pirates, Andrew Wagner. We made a lot of Danish jokes when we first did this set. Michael Kopeck. Chrome, Robert Stevenson, Ice, Ice Baby, Nick Howard out of three ninety nine for the Reds, Chris Oliver. 14 out of 15 for the Phillies. Nice. Yeah, bra breaking, uh, bre case breaking these. was uh case breaking these was pretty much a real hassle Be a couple more autographs out of here. Well, 
These are just facsimile autos. These are just the fake autos that are on there. Nice, Arthur. How's he doing? Eventually, there'll be there'll be some some visual fascination with with all with like the sound and these cards flashing by on the screen. It's good visual stimulation for newborns, right? I would think so. All right, Kyle Freeland is your next autograph. He's pitching pretty well for the Rockies, right? First, he was the eighth overall pick. I had no idea. Well, there you go. Rockies, Reno with the Rocks. Nice Kyle Freeland, pitching very well. Doing good. Here's me talking, looks around. That's good. That's good. Exploring the world. Well, the sound and the visual stimulation is, is good for the for newborns, right? From what I hear. I don't know. I don't I don't have kids. I don't know. There's Forrest Wall for another Rocky. Orange autograph. That's 15 out of 25. I'm not too sure what Forrest Wall story is, but but he was uh, he's also a first round pick, 35th overall. So it's got to count for something, Reno and the Rockies. What, Kyle Freeland? Yeah, I know. Kyle, Kyle Freeland making the Dodgers look like fools. This is true. Well, he's a, he's a, he's a left-hander. Uh, I have no idea what a box of this costs these days. I think box prices on stuff like this always goes, always goes up and down. For the Royals, Miguel Amante, 65 out of 75. And there's supposed to be... Oh, there's five autographs in here. Nick Gordon, nice. I thought there were only three. Nick Gordon autograph. Bit of fuzz right there. Nice one for the Twins. That's uh, for Kev California. D. Gordon's brother. There you go. So we should have one more auto somewhere then, right? There it is, another twin for Kevin. Nick Birdie. Just breeze through these last bits right here. Glass now, Morrison Almonte. There you go. A couple twins, a couple Rockies, and a Pirate. Nice. So, some nice autographs there. Excellent. Gabriel says it's about what? 200, 250 a box? That sounds right. I mean, I think. Just because with the the nature of the prospects and stuff that are in here, the autographs of these early autographs of the people in here, um, I think the prices could go up and down, you know? Yeah, that was 2014. Now, now we're in... To 2015. All right.
right. So now in the world of 2015, that's also 2015, then we'll, we'll roll into the world of 2016. I don't know what box we should do last. Maybe the prime cuts we should do last. Oh, what's a good what's a good break closer? <laughs> high tech maybe? High tech could have some cool stuff. Fourteen has Chris Bryant. I thought thirteen had Chris Bryant. No, his first one, or is it fourteen? I think fourteen is Kyle Schorber, right? I don't know. I mix all this up. Yeah, fourteen I think is Kyle Schorber. I think thirteen is Chris Bryant's first. I don't know. It's all blurs in together. <laughs> I think this this particular year we also did another like 20 case break of this. And Nick Plummer is our first autograph. No number, but for the Redbirds. Set, set that right there. Cardinals with that one. That'll be Michael Van Wy. I think these are different parallels, right? You know, we'll, we'll send those out. I'm pretty sure these are different parallels too. Oh, these chrome get shipped out anyway. See, I don't think they're numbered though. They're not. Oh, it is 14? I didn't think I saw it on the 14 checklist, but... These ones aren't numbered. We got Tyler J, 001 out of 250, uh, purple for Kevin. Ryan Rua, that's a different, I think that's a this Asia edition specific parallel. That goes to the Diamondbacks for Mike Koontz. How many autographs am I looking for in here? All right, so that one had, so this one has three. This is the one that has three. So we got one already. Is this uh, some sort of, yeah, 009 out of 499, Alex Jackson, silver paper for the Mariners. That'll be from Michael Van Wy. So a couple more autographs. Double checking to make sure those aren't numbered. And Tyler J. Twins. For Kev California. There you go, Kevin.
Who plays with the Braves now, Chris Smith? Sorry, there's a bit of a lag, so it's not as instantaneous. Got some green coming up. And that is Kyle Crick. 29 out of 99. Green Chrome. Uh, for the Giants, Chris with the Oppo Joe Mojo. Happy birthday, by the way. Hopefully we can... Still, still plenty of time for big hits out of here. Blue paper, Matt Hall, 20 out of 150. Oh, it's Alex Jackson. He's on the Braves now? Was that part of the deal where that, that put, like, Malik Smith on four different teams or, like, 12 different teams in one day? I think Malik Smith was on, like, all the teams in baseball for one day. <laughs> and for the Rockies, Peter Lambert. Oh, the... Rocky's doing well in these two draft boxes. So those are our three autos unless we unless we get some bonuses. And there we go. These two guys at the end. Nice. All right, let me sleeve some of these guys up. And then we'll move on to uh, 2015 Prism. Oh, you guys got Max Freed in the deal too. Wait, the the Mariners did? I don't know. I, I have no. All I know is that Malik Smith ended up in Tampa Bay somehow by way of Seattle or something like that. That's all. That's all I remember from that day. It's hard to keep track of all that stuff. But I think we got. Speaking of the Mariners, I'm pretty sure we the Dodgers got Chris Taylor, who's hitting really well from Seattle, in the the Zach Lee deal, I think. I don't know, I forget. Well, yeah, that's that's what we were just talking about. You know, I think I think he. Former, I don't have the card next to me anymore. But yeah, I remember he, he was being highly touted pre Hey, that, that's what happens. That's the, that's the, that's baseball. You know what I mean? You know, sometimes prospects don't advance up the, up the minors as steadily or as quickly as others. You can get highly touted and then you don't quite get there. I don't know. I mean. But that, that, that's the beauty of this, uh, of, of all these prospect sets that we just did, you know, finding those guys' autographs and whatnot, um, is that, you know, like, remember when Trevor Story went off last year? Everyone was, like, scrambling through all of their old sets going, hey, do I have a Trevor Story autograph or a parallel sitting around? That's the crazy thing. A lot of late bloomers. Will Myers, look at Will Myers. Guy was considered pretty much a bust after his rookie of the year season. They're like, that's it. Will Myers regressing. But has a home in uh, San Diego now. Carlos Gomez. And Chris Bryant. Autograph. Wow. 43 out of 125. Chris Bryant auto. See, you never know what's going to happen in a mixer like this. Jeremy 33 with the Cubs.
Nice. Evan Longoria to 100. That'll go to the Ray. Sorry about that, Andrew. That's why I have the, the, the padded rubber on here. Carlos Santana, uh, 001 out of 125, Cleveland Indians. That'll go to Kev, California. Those refractors are not numbered. And we have CC Lee, Fresh Faces die cut. I don't think I've ever heard of this guy. For the Indians, that'll go to Kev. Kevin, have you heard of this guy? Hmm. No, but that die cut auto is coming to you. Cal Ripken, I've heard of this guy. Uh, 19 out of 50 for the O's. That'll go to Danny. All right, those are the parallels I'll be sleeping up right here. Chalk Peterson. There's Will Myers. Speaking of Will Myers, 48 out of 99. Padres edition of Will Myers going to Ryan. See, now, now, now we're breezing along. Yeah, it is a pretty cool auto, though. All right, there you go. And, of course, the big hit out of this box... Chris Bryant to 125. Not too shabby at all. All right. I think we'll save prime cuts for last. Maybe we'll do Bowman Inception in tier one first. All right. Well, one, two, three, four, five boxes left. Got to get TJ on the board. He's like, <laughs> I would take any A or Blue Jay right now. Kev California saying CC Lee is now in the Rockies organization. Okay. All right, we're going to start off with an autograph for the tribe, Omar Vizquel. 006 out of 299, going to Kev, California, and the Indians. There you go, Kevin. And Mac Williamson, return of the Mac, 127 out of 199. That is for... Chris and the Giants, opposite Joe Mojo. And Relic. 007, do 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 do, out of 2.99. Laser Show, Dustin Pedroia. Laser Show. Look at look that up on YouTube. Dustin Pedroia, Laser Show. <laughs> I think it's kind of one of the most hilarious things. I don't know why I think it's funny. Maybe no one else does. Maybe no. Maybe outside no one out of Boston. Outside Boston, maybe no one else thinks it's funny. But I do. All right. Justice is served. Justice Sheffield. Another one for Kev California and the Indians. Cleveland. For California. Uh, Tra is it Trey Mancini or Trey Mancini? I honestly don't know. But that's a nice one for the Orioles. Danny with that one. Hey, we were just talking about you. There's Malik Smith. This is still Braves edition of Malik's. That goes to Michael Van Wy. It's see, it's Mancini. Is Mancini like too Italian-y, I guess? Maybe that's more. Maybe the Mancini, I feel like it's a little more. 39 out of, where is the Odyssey? 39 out of 50, Luci Lucius Fox. That goes to the Giants. You're right. I was like, I'm missing something. <laughs> that's why I was confused, where I was like, what box should we end with? Jake Bowers, Relic. 
and autograph for the Rays. That'll go to Andrew Wagner. High Tech Baseball. I owe you guys a... Because uh, we... Hold on. So we did the 2015. We did the 14. I'm about to do these two tech. Uh, Inception I just did. Prism I just did. 2013 I just did. Prime Cuts is still on the table. Tier 1 I just did. And so yeah, we got. I'll get you an Odyssey. I knew there was something missing. Yeah, that'll be the last box open. Good call. Good eye, TJ. Good eye. Thank you. I know. Seriously, right? Short you guys a box. Then I'll be that guy. I don't want to be that guy. All right. Ken Griffey Jr. <laughs> Had to check an email, but no clicking. Uh, Corey Seager. Nice one for the Dodgers. Big Boys 007. Oh, Dave's a Giants fan. He's going to love that one. And I've heard of this guy. That's Babe Ruth. Nice. I think the year before, these used to be numbered to five, but still nice. Nice one for the Yankees. That goes to Michael Van Wy. Autograph? Yes, Jose Barrios. We got Tyler J and Jose Barrios, Kevin. So there you go, Twins Auto. And this is a short print right here, Yvonne Rodriguez. There's Malik Smith and Juan Gonzalez. There's no Sports Jeopardy on tonight? They're showing, they're, NBC's doing poker right now. I was hoping for Sports Jeopardy. Also, this mixer went by a lot faster than I thought it would. All right. Andrew McCutcheon. Frank Thomas. Felix Hernandez. Omar Vizquel. And... Nice, Tom Glavin, 15 out of 20. Is this an Asia exclusive parallel with like the blue? Yeah, I'm not sure, let me get this dust off of there. But anyway, nice, Braves, Michael Van Wy with the Braves. Kettle Marte, 41 out of 60. It is an Asia exclusive, says TJ. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. All right, nice. Okay, I still I'm gonna do this really quick, but I still owe you a uh, still owe you an Odyssey box. No, oh, they go this, this goes this way. Um, Big Boys 007, David. No, unfortunately, no no huge Dodger Joe Mojo. I'm afraid, not yet anyway. All right, we're gonna start with 13 out of 149, Buster Posey, who has like five home runs in the last week, I think, or something like that. He's power surge. That goes to Chris McKeague and the Giants. Cal Ripken, 55 out of 149. It's hard to show you the wrinkle right there, but that's pretty cool, a little wrinkle in that jersey. Nice, for the O's. That'll go to Danny. This is a pretty sweet one right here. Sweet Lou Brock. 75 out of 99. Piece of the bat right there for the Cardinals. And that goes to Michael Van Wy. Uh, not the race car driver, but the reliever for the Cubs. 25 out of 49, Triple Relic and Auto, Carl Edwards Jr. Carl Edwards Jr. Jeremy 33 and the Cubbies. Nice. And, wow. Piece of the bat and the autograph, two out of three, Carl Yastrzemski, yes. Who has the red, Jeremy 33 with the Red Sox. 
I, I was not expecting that at all. So a piece of Yaz's bat and his autograph. Two out of three. First train whistle of the break, Jeremy 33. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo! There you go. All right. That was Prime Cuts. Let me grab a box of 2017 Odyssey. All right, here we go. I know, I know. Dodgers lose is terrible. I think, I think like a third of your wins, Dave, your third of your seventeen wins now are uh, <laughs> are from the Dodgers. All right. So this is 2017 TriStar Odyssey baseball. There could be cut autos in there, all sorts of stuff. Uh, just want to explain the house rules really quick before before we do this. If there is so basically, if it's not a card with the player and the team is clearly on it, you know. If it's nothing like that, then it'll go to the team that, he, for example, a cut autograph. It'll go to the team that he played for the longest. Um, yeah, so unless there's any clear like team indication on here, it'll go to the team that he played for the longest. It's kind of like our college rules when we do football breaks. If the if a player is in his college uniform, if he's active, it'll go to the team that he's currently on. If if he's so example, I don't know why there would be a cut autograph of an active player, but if that were to happen, that'll go to the team that he's currently on, um, and. You know, if he's no longer active, I'll go to the team he played for the longest using baseballreference.com. Seasons played, and then tiebreaker uh, games played. All right. Oh, this is. TriStar usually gives us like a. Don't they give us a card? Aha. Yes. All right. Oh, this is pretty easy. Okay, here we go. You guys ready? I like to do this trivia. I feel like a game show host when I do this. Uh, he's a six-time All-Star. I'm trying to like read some stuff that will, won't give it away. Six-time All-Star. He's a pitcher, by the way. Six-time All-Star. Two-time Silver Slugger. 1986 Gold Glove Award. 1986 NL Wins Champion. In 1990, he pitched a no-hitter. 1990 pitched a no-hitter. I think this is where this is where it'll start to give it away. Uh, I'm going to wait a little. I know there's a little bit of a lag on YouTube. I'm going to wait a little bit. Any guesses from anybody after all, all that information? There's there's more obvious information coming up. I know the wheels in your head are turning. I don't see any guesses in the chat yet. Six-time All-Star, 86 Gold Glove Award, 86 NL Wins Champion, 1990 pitched a no-hitter, two-time Silver Slugger. No guesses. That means people are like on Google right now researching. All right, so before that happens, he's a 1981 MLB Strikeout Champion, 1981... World Series champion. Oh, I think Kev California might have gotten it before the lag. He says Fernando. Yep, it's Fernando. There he is. Fernando Valenzuela. Six-time All-Star, 81 World Series champion, 81 NL Cy Young Award winner, 81 MLB Strikeout champion, 81 NL Rookie of the Year, won the Gold Glove in 86, couple Silver Sluggers, was also the Wins champion in 86, and a no-hitter in 1990. Yeah, he had already been like nine, ten years in the league at that point. Arthur was saying Dave Stewart. I think you got you got the era. All right, nice. Let's check it out. Wow, nice. There you go. So on a, on this postcard right here, look at his eyes to the sky. There he is, Fernando Valenzuela. Authenticated right here. PSA. There's the back. 
Very cool for Big Boys 007. Getting that Dodger Joe Mojo. And he's a Giants guy too. So there you go, man. There is the big one. All right. And that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. Oh, we're going to discuss off camera who had a bigger mania, Fernando or Nomo. That's a teaser to watch the live streams Monday through Saturday, 3 o'clock Pacific to 11 o'clock Pacific. This is Joe. We'll see you next time on jazbeeshobbyland.com. Bye-bye.